So in this video, I'm gonna go over with the the uh, how to map a network drive. So basically, a network drive is uh, um, when you click on. I hate it when you can't find my computer here. This PC. So these are all of your drives right so mainly these are what are actually on your computer these are the network one you see network locations <clears throat> so you can access them and just see if you want uh, a for example you access uh, a certain portal this one you can create a shortcut you can send it to desktop or you can create a shortcut anywhere with the uh, <clears throat> for example if you access it from the desktop or you can send a shortcut <coughs> like create a shortcut through this and places in a within a folder <coughs> so what for network drive you have to have that path and for example when I, when I joined this uh, company they so each company has different thing but all they all have a file server <coughs> and you get the your space on the server which is running 24 7 that is when you're working in a domain domain environment and yeah uh, you get the benefit of um, <coughs> sitting on different uh, using any computer right uh, it's uh, it's not like you have a your special cubicle and you sit here there sometime you have to go and use uh, another computer <clears throat> another floor something like that so what happens is whatever you have so saved locally uh, stays in this computer for example whatever this new folder is not showing up on the server but or maybe another computer that I sit in I'm not running all my virtual machines right now so as you see everything is off but you get the idea uh, so whatever I am working on this computer and the next day somebody else is sitting there or for some reason that computer is not letting me work it's not loading uh, the files or websites that i have to work with <clears throat> and temporarily i have to sit on another pc uh, then the network lo location comes into play that is basically uh, you can sh share all your files over there and with, wherever you sit you can go to that location and access them but what if like in my case I have the same PC every day no matter what I sit on that cubic in that cubicle every day and yes all of my files can be saved on that local computer and no problems <coughs> right but there is a network location where they update the files and I have to constantly access that like each day I have to go and access that <coughs> there's there are many different ways for example I for one location I get the email so I have to check my email every day and copy that link for I can do the same for this map uh, network location as well I can put that in the email and just click it or make a, a shortcut on the uh, <coughs> like here use the shortcut but what if I want to have that uh, like Windows have the feature that you can network that map that network drive and put it as a drive in your computer like uh, um, this piece like uh, C or D and all you have to do is just click on that one and it opens up right exactly that folder for example just for example that I have to <coughs> access uh, network oh come on network let's uh, open a new window <clears throat> for clarity so what if I have to network right so I have to go to this is the physical computer over there but pretend it's a server like our server they have a name and then they have, there is a shared drive then there are gazillions folders I kid you not there are so many folders because each user have their own folder and then there's uh, folders that 
uh, you can access them uh, and some folders are for everybody so when you go over there for example Windows 8 C that I have to click every day to get to for example this file or any file right so how many clicks are this uh, one two three four five six so I have to click six times and I have to remember this path yes I can save it but there's an easier way to put it as a network drive so whatever the content is there it shows up as a drive on your here and you're happy so for example this PC <coughs> you go to map a network drive and you pick any of this you see C is used B E F G H everything is available ah, D is not available because D is used all right so my name is Imran let's see it's my location and I put A is the, oh sorry I there so I copied pasted this uh, uh, web address but I could browse as well go through everything and click OK and it will do the same once I click finish <coughs> there was an option that it will say uh, connect at the um, startup like as soon as you're logged in it connects to this one so what you see it acts up uh, between this and this the only differences in the icon is that it, it looks like a network connected and you that's how you know that it's a network drive and when you click it takes me directly to that folder and I can access all of that it's very easy one step uh, it uh, uh, makes your life so much easier so this is how you map a network drive and this is why it's being used yes there are other ways but this is the most elegant way and this uh, just sits in your my computer if you like this video please rate comment share and subscribe and you have a good night